This is a really difficult problem. All the chest wall deformities are a big problem because th these are, are really cosmetic defects that do have some physiologic impact, but often not enough to, to warrant people's attention or even to get approval from insurance companies to get it corrected. Yet it has so much to do with the kid's body image. They're, they're ashamed of their bodies. They won't, they won't take their shirts off in public. They won't go to a swimming pool. They won't go to a gym. They won't date. Uh, it has a huge impact on their life. It's huge to have Marcelo here because um, Marcelo is the one who came up with this concept and developed this brace. When Marcelo developed his brace, this dynamic compression brace, and suddenly it changed the whole paradigm of how we could treat these. The brace is low profile, so you can wear it under a shirt uh, and not really be noticed. It's more comfortable, so the kids are wearing to wear it, you know, for 12, 16 hours a day during the initial phase when we're getting the correction. Um, then they can wear it like a re you wear a retainer after you get your teeth fixed and your braces. And so it takes a process which really didn't work very well, was very bulky, and took years to a process that now can be corrected in, in many cases in a much shorter period of time. It's great because when we... Um first had kind of noticed that his chest was uh, protruding and we went in to see the doctors. That was really what they had prescribed was surgery. We were a little concerned about it and we actually postponed it because we really wanted to think about it because um, it would have meant that, you know, he'd want to have surgery, he'd have a scar. When we called back and said, all right, you know what, I think we're going to go go through with it. They said, oh, guess what? We have another alternative. And I said, oh, great, that would be wonderful. And so it turns out that there's this new brace. And so we were just thrilled to kind of hear about it. And Jack actually turns out that he's a really good candidate for it. So it's just, it's, it's great. Pediatricians, everybody will tell them, don't perform the surgery because it's, it's right. The surgery was very aggressive. But it happened that when we started to, to use this brace, now everybody starts to know and we get hundreds of patients, more than we could ever imagine. I'm really excited about it. One, because, uh, you know, I think it's, it's, a, it's the right answer for the problem. Two, because I think it's something that the parents and the kids can buy in for. Three, because I think it will change the body image of these children. Um, I would definitely recommend them to go through with this because this is the much better alternative to surgery. And it'll probably take a longer time, but you know, it doesn't really matter. It's better than surgery.